Stuber is an action comedy directed by Michael Douse and stars Dave Bautista as Vic, a detective with very bad eyesight who is on the hunt for a drug lord, and Kumail Nanjiani as Stu, an Uber driver who he manages to bump into. And in this movie, the two of them get put into this very awkward position. But it's through this awkward position and the whole day that they're with each other, doing all kinds of crazy shit, where they eventually become good friends. So this is essentially a buddy cop movie, and one that I think is done pretty well. It was funny and I really enjoyed seeing the chemistry between Dave and Kamel. Despite what people have said, I think they are a pretty funny duo. It's basically like putting two people with completely different personalities together for a whole day. And so it was pretty fun to watch that unfold. And I'd say they were probably the best part of this movie. The story was okay, I mean I enjoyed it but it wasn't the best, like it's not the most coherent. Like if someone said that the story was messy and just wasn't that good, then I'd completely understand. But I thought it was good enough for this type of movie. Some things don't really make any sense. For instance, Dave Bautista's character Vic was like almost a blind man. Like it shows you his vision in the movie and it was pretty blurry. So I was wondering like is his vision actually that shit? because he was walking almost fine throughout this whole movie. He was bumping into stuff, yes, but there were times, a lot of times, where he wasn't. Also, there was this whole subplot with Stu and Becca, a girl that he really liked, and they turned that into something emotional, but I think that the pacing of those parts were a bit off. Like, I find it very hard to believe that she waited a whole day for a guy to come over. And they could have left all of that out, to be honest, because if you want emotion, you've kind of got it with seeing the relationship between Vic and his daughter. Even though it is subtle, it's still there. And I like how this movie explores the themes of just family and life decisions. Although I have to say, the antagonists of this movie were probably the weakest point. Like, they didn't really offer anything else for the story other than just being the bad guys. But that's probably not what most people came to see in the first place. I mean, I know I came to see it because I thought that the trailer was marketed pretty well. I wanted to see a hilarious buddy cop movie and that's exactly what I got. I'd say that this movie was, it felt like a steady roller coaster down. Like it started off high with some very interesting backstory and intense action, but then it just goes like down kind of like this but it was still mildly enjoyable towards the end. There's also not a whole lot of action, like most of the time it'd just be people talking and doing things, traveling I guess, like going from one place to the next. And there's also a lot of slapstick humor, but I think most of it worked. I had a lot of fun in the movie theater with this movie. It was pretty funny, like it was more than just a chuckle. There are some forced sexual jokes that I think just didn't work whatsoever, but luckily there aren't that many and it stops pretty quickly. I feel like this is a movie that will be overlooked by a lot of people. Like it doesn't, it's not a film that particularly stands out. The movie theaters were dead when this movie first got released. Like I was the only person in the theater and also a lot of critics aren't really talking about it either. But if you're looking for a fun and relaxed time, then I highly recommend this movie. I think Stuber is the perfect popcorn flick. I'm going to give Stuber a B minus. Now I know after watching this movie why they called it Stuber. And honestly, I've been pronouncing it Stubber this whole time like an idiot. But anyway guys, thank you so much for watching. Have you seen Stuber? What did you think about it? Please leave a comment about your thoughts below. Like the video if you liked it, and drop a sub to help the channel out. Also, feel free to check out my previous video. Until next time.